Hello and welcome to our third and final pumpkin activity for Clyde Ciders magazine. I'm Susan and I'm going to show you what to do with the pumpkin after Halloween and how to roast the seeds for snacks. We're going to start by roasting the seeds. Preheat your oven to 200 degrees. The first thing we need to do is clean all the flesh off the pumpkin seeds. Next we're going to boil the seeds for around 10 minutes or so, just to cook them inside. After you've boiled and then drained your seeds, mix with some oil and seasoning of your choice. I ended up choosing salt and a little bit of black pepper. Put your seeds onto a baking tray and space them out evenly for going in the oven. And here's that black pepper I was talking about. Put the seeds into the preheated oven at 200 degrees for 10 minutes and then take them out to turn them. Put the seeds back into the oven for another 10 minutes or until they're darker yellow but not brown. Don't leave them too long. And here they are, just out the oven. You can either snack on them as they are, or you can break the shells open and eat the inside. And now it's time to make our bird feeder. According to Charity Hubbub, every year at Halloween, nearly 95% of UK grown pumpkins are simply thrown away. Here's a wee idea to repurpose your lantern into something that's a little bit more environmentally friendly. To make your bird feeder, you will need some wooden skewers, some seeds, some thumbtacks, some string, and a pair of scissors. You need to look for the best place to cut your pumpkin in half and then taking a sharp knife we're going to cut round very slowly and carefully. Same as before, any waste that we can no longer use please put in a food waste bin or in a composter. Now we're going to just put some wooden skewer through the pumpkin to make perches for the birds. Cut two long lengths of string and knot together in the centre. Turn your pumpkin upside down and secure the knot to the very bottom using thumbtacks. And now just add some bird seed. I'm also going to share some of my roasted pumpkin seeds with the birds, but please remember they'd be happy enough to eat them raw. And here's the final product. I did try and take a video of all the wildlife and birds feeding at the pumpkin, but uh, unfortunately I think they were hiding this day. I did however manage to get this excellent photo of our resident squirrel, Mike. Thank you so much for watching these videos that are designed to help cut down Halloween waste and be kinder to the environment. Please share these ideas with others and join Clyde Ciders and myself on social media for more creative ideas. Most of all, I hope you have a happy Halloween. See you later.